and welcome back to the farmhouse. I am Dan from Hummingbird Acres. And as you can see, no camper. So we are getting ready for another camping weekend. And I thought I would take you guys along and show you the camper and everything that we love about it. So when you walk in the front door, on your right is the master bedroom. So this is our master. We, just this year, we turned this bed so it was up against the wall. And then granddad built us this awesome dresser, which gives us so much floor space. So I keep all of our clothes and all of our camera gear in that cabinet. And Jamie keeps all of his clothes in that one. So master bedroom and then when you walk right in you walk into the living space so I'm gonna stand here into a pan and the kitchen so all of that is there this couch folds down into a bed and it has storage underneath and the dinette also folds down into a bed and there are storage under both seats this is our kitchen so we used to have the standard camper stove oven combo and we actually removed it. We put in this Insta Omni Plus and then on top of the butcher block, we put an induction cooktop. So that has like been a game changer. And then you can see my sourdough sitting on top. And then the sink over there. Normally the coffee maker is there, but because it's summer, I'm not drinking hot coffee. So I have the cold coffee thing. And then this is this view. We added the TV, but that did come with the fireplace in when we camp in the fall and in the winter, we can run that fireplace for heat. And then we have another heater in the back and we don't have to run our propane heat at all. So back in the kitchen, we do have a microwave and we have a pretty decent size freezer and a pretty, I'm going to knock over the trash can. Decent size refrigerator. So. And then we walk back here. This is our pantry. This is the top. Jamie added the shelves in it because it did not come with shelves. So we have all the shelves there. And then we also have more food at the bottom as well. And then if you swing this way. This door goes into our bathroom and we added the baskets and then we have, we added this plastic storage tubs there. So it's a pretty decent size bathroom. And then this has stuff in it right now, but let me open it. We do have a tub, not a standing shower, which I really like. And the goal is to put a skylight in the ceiling eventually so that Jamie can stand in there a little more comfortably. So that's the bathroom. And then this is what sold us on this camper. So when you walk back here, this is the bunkhouse. So we have two beds on this side, 
all of that is storage and the TV. And then we have two more beds on this side. And the bottom was a couch that we took out and we put in this bed from Ikea. And then I built all of those wooden boxes underneath. And then when you open up the boxes is where each kid keeps all of their clothing. So we have Marisol, Henley, and the boys. And then we have a laundry basket there. And so that they don't fall out of the bed, we have the gates up. And then when you open the cabinets, stuff might fall out of here, but this is because we just set up and everything is kind of jostled. But there, another big cabinet here. And kind of the same on this side as well. So lots of storage space back here. And then because Marisol is still little, she sleeps in the pack and play, but eventually we will forego the pack and play. And, uh, excuse me, she'll sleep in one of the bunks. So this is what sold us. We walked into this camper and was like, we're done. This is what we want. This is our forever camper. Oh, and I forgot underneath all of those bins have toys. So win-win, but yeah, we walked into this camper and we were like sold. This is our forever camper. So I am going to turn so you can get a look. This is what it looks like when you walk out of the bunkhouse. And then the cabinets underneath the TV, one has snacks and the other one has um, like our Tupperware and our cups and stuff. So that is the inside of the camper. And in a little bit, I will show you the outside. So I showed you guys the inside of our camper as we were setting up. So now I'm gonna show you the outside of our camper as we're kind of breaking it all down. So this is what the outside looks like. Um, we do travel with two folding tables. We use one up against the table, one up against the camper, which you can see right there. And that's normally where we like serve food and stuff when we do dinners. And then we use another one to either sit at or as another serving. Right now it's being used as our dishwashing station. So, and then we have this really big mat that I absolutely love. This is an oversized one, which is actually bigger than the normal ones you would get. This front compartment houses all of our chairs, everything we use to set up the camper, uh, our folding trash can. We have a fly bag on the front of the camper right now because the flies are bad here. The dog stuff. So we also upgraded the handle getting in and out. This one is the handicap handle, which makes it easier for the kids to get in and out. They can grab onto the handle. But the coolest part of outside is probably this outside kitchen. So we have the refrigerator, we have a little sink, There's the, and then we have an ice maker, and the box is for the ice maker. So Jamie's getting ready to pack all of that up. And then my dad and Jamie, um, or my mother-in-law had gotten us a Blackstone for, I guess it was Jamie's birthday. And then my dad and Jamie figured out how to attach it to the bumper of our camper. And it's on an arm that swings out and it's right there. And I have to say, this is probably one of the best things that we've gotten for the camper. We cooked 13 cheese, chicken and cheese quesadillas last night and it took us less than 10 minutes. It was awesome. He can cook three pounds of bacon in under like 30 minutes. Blackstone, one of the best purchases you can get for your camper. So we love our Blackstone, but anyway, I'm going to back up some more. You guys can see this is our camper from the outside from this side, and I will walk you around the other side. There's not much on the other side. Basically, we live out here on this side of the camper, but this is the back. And then you see we have, let's do this. So this is the backside of our camper and 
you can see we have two huge windows in our living space which are great for letting in natural light which I love and then we have the bump out on this side for the bunkhouse. So this is our camper. Um, we love camping. We try to camp at least once a month if not more. It is just something fun and the kids absolutely love it. But thanks for coming along on our camper tour today and thanks for following our channel. Um, I would say welcome to the farmhouse, but we're not exactly at the farmhouse today. So have a great day and we'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks for stopping by the farmhouse today. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Please subscribe to our channel to see all of our homesteading adventures and visit our website hummingbird-acres.com for more inspiration for your homestead.